Hello everybody, Marty Richards with Greater Richland Tourism here today. And we are really excited to tell you about our second annual yes. Pumpkin Fest right here in the Greater Richland area in downtown Richland Center. Today I have Suzanne Anderson here to tell us all about and Suzanne, you're really the pumpkin czar, right? Well, I started it last year. Yeah. I brought it from our hometown yeah. in uh, Sycamore, Illinois. Yep. And uh, it's been 77 years long in Sycamore, and we're on year two. So we're pretty excited we'll this year. We'll keep growing it, right? Yeah, we're going to keep growing yeah. it every year. In fact, I talked to the folks at the Simon Center, and they're willing to get a 10K run in for next year. So awesome. we're so excited for that. Good deal. Yeah. So can you give us uh, just a little bit of the update on... Uh, Pumpkin pickup, pumpkin sure. delivery, judging sure. the events of that week. You bet. Uh, Saturday, um, I'm sorry, Saturday, October 19th, there's going to be a pumpkin pickup, free okay. pumpkins, at the fire station along with the fire station open house. So we've got that going. And that will be from 9 until 1. Okay. So you don't have a pumpkin, you don't have to pick up a free pumpkin, but you're sure welcome to have a free pumpkin. Otherwise, you can pick up a pumpkin anywhere you like. Uh, that's on uh, Saturday the 19th. Then on Wednesday, October 23rd, right here on these grounds, come right here, we're gonna have check-in, and it's going to be uh, from 3.30 to 7 on uh, Wednesday, October 23rd, and that is for pumpkin drop-off. And you bring your pumpkin, you'll either pre-register, or you can do it right here at on the grounds. So we'll help you if you don't know what category to go in, but there's lots of categories, that's on Wednesday. Uh, Thursday, of course, will be the judging, Marty, on yep. all the pumpkins uh, for, with a couple local uh, art teachers that are going to do the judging for us. Uh, that's kind of the lull day. Uh, Friday is the big day when anything everything happens. There's a lot of um, trick-or-treating at Cross Cup Park. Yep. And then uh, down here, back down here at 7 p.m. for a costume contest for the kids. And the kids will know the pumpkins winners by then and we're going to have little prizes for them on on friday excellent saturday is a big day yeah so saturday is when all the activity really does start right down here this street central avenue is going to be closed between uh, seminary and um uh hazel time, hazel time. and that's going to be closed off and we're going to have a pumpkin petal pool we're going to have face painting we're going to have a pie eating contest sponsored by the lions and the Key Club is uh, coming to us with a bunch of activities, and I'm not sure what those are, but they'll be here too. There's going to be a food truck down here, some music, and it'll be a lot of fun. Most all day, then head on over to Eagle School for a um, craft fall craft show at Eagle School okay. from uh, 10 until 3. Excellent. And the I thought the theme this year was pretty cool. Very cool. I've seen the float, been in the Canyon yeah. of Lights Parade, and also yeah. in the Homecoming Parade. Yes. The theme for this year? Is pumpkins in a galaxy far, far away. So a lot of opportunity to a do things with that. Yeah. And that's, I was struck by that last year, uh, the creativity of some of the creations. Yeah. Um, and then after I saw, it was kind of funny because the young man that won, uh, that was like the high school age group, uh, he said that really wasn't all I wanted to do, there was more. And I thought, well, you got another year. So oh, yeah, yeah I, I'm kind of looking forward to the creativity of all the people that bring pumpkins. Yes, so. this year we have a new uh, challenge for the school age kids, high school or any school actually, a STEM challenge. Okay. So uh, science, technology, engineering, and math, The yep. all the criteria and the rubric is on our Facebook page. Yep. So kids and teachers can go to that and try, try to create. There is spatial, issues so we got four by four they're gonna actually create something and hopefully it will be the, to the theme of pumpkins in a galaxy far far away. so a pumpkin catapult that could launch it over the park hotel exactly. maybe not enough room exactly for whatever okay. these kids come up with is great <laughs> yeah um so uh if somebody's looking for information again so they could see the categories yep see the full schedule where is the best place to get that in i would say the richland center pumpkin fest page yep uh, on facebook okay also the um richland center tourism yep. or, on the calendar yep, of events on the calendar of events yep. so, okay. so you guys cover it pretty well for us and you we're bet. very happy about that awesome well thank you for thank joining you. us suzanne we we'll hope we have yeah. a great great successful Thank event you. which i'm sure we will we will you hopefully bet. it'll be great thank you for joining thank us you. today for greater richland tourism i'm marty richards let's everybody have a great day